there, underneath that bridge, here in Los Angeles, lives a homeless family. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to help them out. We're going to give them a little break. Watch this. See this shit? You see this shit? This is the homeless in Los Angeles. It smells like raw piss under this bridge. There he goes. There goes one of them, I think. Pizza for five dollars. I'm fixing it. Just let me give some my guy this. All five. I'll buy you a five dollar pizza. All y'all. Okay. Did you buy me a laundry card to drive my car instead of food? No, I get the pizza. I get the. I get the pizza. Get y'all a pizza. Hey, what do y'all what, what do y'all want? Or you don't care? I gotcha. I'll be back. I mean, these people are doing their best with what little they got. They deserve a little break, and I'll be happy to give it to them. There he goes. There goes one of them, I think. Awesome. 
something for you. I love food. Okay, if you want, hey, I'm, if I go buy you uh, a sandwich before you leave it, Okay. Hey, I'm fixing. Hey, good news, y'all. I'm fixing to buy y'all a pizza for five dollars. I'm fixing it. Just let me give some my guy. This all five. I'll buy you a five dollar pizza, all y'all. I'll get y'all a pizza. Hey, what do y'all what, what do y'all want or you don't care? I'll gotcha. I'll be back. Right. No, you you go in they got panic so I get a Panda Express. No, no. You go to 7-Eleven, we're going to wait for you, right? Okay, now what right Now what am I getting for you? We're going to show you what you're getting. I don't know. Okay. Same thing. Okay. I got, I'll, get, I'll get you the $7. I'm going to show you. Okay. 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 I know y'all making bed, making do with what y'all got. I've been where, I know I haven't been where you're at, but I've been a beggar and a penhead before. Oh, I'm not a beggar. I'm an actor. It's still just begging. I'll act, but I'm, I won't beg nobody. Okay. Begging and action is two different things. Yeah. What I'm saying. I'll act you because see, I've been told no all my life. But guess what? You might say yes, and I never know unless I ask. Exactly. Oh yeah, exactly. But see, if you used to say been told no, when you say no, it don't hurt my feelings. I've been told no, it all my just life. go to the next person. Yes. Uh, that's how I got to LA. I asked. Them Hey, look, you, you, look, put this on YouTube. I am. My name is Julio J. And guess what? Okay. What I do is I am professional. I, I'm trying to die six million dollars in debt. I was gonna say the nigga dies in pain. How you doing? Oh, I love you, man. And I got it for him. Yeah. We got somebody to feel sorry for the homies and beat Look here, he gonna get a uh, 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 It's more than feeling sorry for you. I want to give you all a break because I, you know. Yeah, that was that. And enjoy the meal. We have somebody, man. Okay. How much is it gonna be? Uh, so far, How much? Uh, okay. Uh, you take debit cards? Yes. Good. Here, enjoy every bit of it. Hey, come on, let's go do the interview. Okay. Now look, if you get a million hits on YouTube, take the sir. Okay. Get the spoons in the books. Okay. How long have you been living under the bridge? I'm a hooligan, and I like the bridge. Guess what? The white man told me how to get the same kind of power. I live in Madison. I live under the bridge. Yeah. But <coughs> how, how long have you been living under the bridge? Hey, ma'am. How long have you been living under the bridge? Hey, ma'am. How long have you been living under the bridge? Okay. Well, I wish y'all the best. <coughs> and I will hope God blesses y'all. I'll see y'all later. Peace out. Enjoy the meal. Who needs big government welfare programs to help the poor when the private sector can do it better and more efficiently and make sure they get food, not just give, give them money to throw away, but be there by their sides to make sure they eat. To help the truly needy. The truly needy. And they they truly deserved it. So I was happy to help them. Is that my friend is how it is better for the private sector to feed and help the poor than an inept government. You see, if somebody comes up to you and asks for some money, ask them what do they want it for. 
I want bottom of something to eat or something to drink or whatever. But the truly eat. Offer to get them what they need. To take them to the store and get them what they need. But they say, oh no, I'll go get it, I'll go get it. Nine, nine thousand, nine hundred and nine nine times out of a man. They just want the money so they can you get some beer or alcohol. Don't give it to the men, but they truly need it. They'll be more than happy to let you take them to the store and buy them something to eat. Or drink. Or wash their clothes, whatever. You gotta be wise or something. But it's harmless it does. And the government bureaucracy is neither. Bunch of dumb fucking bureaucrats you really don't give a god fuck about the people that are help, trying to help. It's just a job. They can't wait till 5 8 5 and they can go get drunk in the fucking bars. Just like those fucking riders on riders on skid row. At least the riders have a fucking excuse. Welfare fraud. Leak to the private sector to help the poor. And let the government, instead of, let the government encourage the private sector to help the poor. With tax breaks or whatnot, whatever it takes. Give tax breaks to businesses, restaurants that, food that's left over, that is still good but not good enough for them to give to the poor who need it to eat. And give tax breaks to the companies that do that instead of trying to force them to. We can do this, people. We the people. The government can, but we can. <laughs> You get the fucking picture. Or get the fucking video, god damn it. Now, I'm not gonna get no reward, any reward in heaven for what I just did because y'all are watching this on YouTube. And everybody, I'm doing this now and letting y'all see this. But really, as long as those two people are happy and have a little happiness for a little while, I'm happy. Reward or no reward. They're my reward. Even more important than getting these views on YouTube. If only all of us could be happy in the end, that'd make me happy. If only God loved us all eternally, unconditionally, I'd be so freaking happy. Even if I couldn't be the good looking guy with long arms, I wouldn't be happy about that, but at least I'd be happy. In the deepest sense of the word. I'd still want those long arms and good looks, but I'd really be happy. And for best results, if you want to do this, if you want the best way to make God happy, is when you do this, don't be like Oprah Winfrey, help the poor, and then broadcast it to everybody in the world for what I'm doing, put it on YouTube. Do it when nobody knows but you and God. And not so you can get a reward in heaven, but so that you can make someone else happy, and then make God happy. And that's the best way to do this thing. Because, because you got one thing, you got love. Love is the most powerful force in the world. True love. And I'm not talking about love for yourself either. I'm talking about love for others. At the expense of yourself. And I ain't got that kind of love for them. But you know, it does feel good to help somebody else. Yeah, I'm done. I mean, how the fuck can anybody stand to live in these kind of type of conditions? What kind of bad luck, how down on your luck do you have to get, have to live underneath the bridge like this where it smells like piss? Man, I, I'm getting sick just walking back and forth under this bridge every day. I'm getting sh sh my, my head feels like it's lightheaded. They have to do this constantly. I guess the body adapts to it. Anybody want the rest of this pizza? Stop taking pictures though, man. That's not good. It's off.
maybe he wants a little alcohol. Can you blame him in, this, in a dismal life like this? Still, I'm not going to support nobody getting drunk. Although, I don't know. Maybe they need a little happiness. If they could get drunk and still be in control of their facilities. Man, if I had to live like that, no hope of ever making it as a rapper. Man, that's... Oh, no, I would kill myself. I mean, fuck this shit. See this shit? <gasps> you see this shit? Having to live under that goddamn bridge. That nasty, you know. That nasty. Fuck that shit. Are there no homeless shelters? What if they're like the one in Kiss and they don't let you come in until they've gotten a fucking police report on your ass? We got here. What the fuck we got here? God damn it, this camera's all fucking shot. Yeah, we got the LAPD got somebody in trouble.